You know a true luxury SUV when you see it, smell it, and feel it. Styling with presence, aromatic materials, and sumptuous seats wrapped in supple leather are the hallmarks of a genuinely luxurious vehicle. Add high-tech convenience, infotainment, and safety systems, and you've got yourself an SUV worthy of both desire and the price listed on the window sticker. But if you are buying a luxury SUV, you probably need the space for both your favorite people and their luggage. That's where a full-size luxury SUV comes in handy, supplying plenty of room for passengers or cargo or both. Sounds good, doesn't it? If you are looking for the best full-size luxury SUVs, this list will let you know about them. The 2020 Range Rover Long Wheelbase Once a rough-and-tumble workhorse, the 2020 Range Rover now represents the pinnacle of the Land Rover lineup with a plush cabin, a host of tech goodies, and a six-figure price tag to match. It's still highly capable off-road, maybe even more so than the original, but the Range Rover tackles both trails and suburban byways, while providing a comfortable ride, richly upholstered seats, genuine wood trip, and touchscreen infotainment. The boxy exterior styling is synonymous with wealth and status, so parking one in your driveway is the automotive equivalent to donning a Rolex Submariner on your wrist. Like most everything, it doesn't come without compromises. Fuel economy isn't great, driving dynamics are clumsy, and the infotainment system is a little bit buggy. If you are looking for luxury and status though, not many SUVs will provide both quite like it. Under the hood of this giant is a 575 horsepower supercharged V8 that pushes it in 4.3 seconds to 60 miles per hour with a confident albeit slightly muted exhaust note. But for most buyers that it targets, this engine is bound to be very satisfying indeed. The 2020 Ford Expedition If the only solution to surviving the end of the world was a road trip, you could fit two of every animal in the Ford Expedition with enough room left over for a suitcase or two. The largest SUV in Ford's lineup has stepped forward again confidently in 2020 and continues to tower over many of its rivals with capability, generous standard features, and a tremendous amount of space. A fantastic contender for a large family, the Expedition delivers on comfort and practicality without compromising on its appearance and is well-rounded for its segment by many measures. The Burley SUV takes up a lot of space on the road, but with a little more finesse to its design than the likes of the Chevy Tahoe. Ford approached the family hauler with a bigger is better attitude in all senses, so there is an imposing grill and stocky look in general. Halogen headlights are standard on the lower trims, with the Ken Ranch and Platinum trim levels favoring chrome fronts and LED headlights instead. The same concept applies to the rear lights. Retractable door runners found on the limited trim and above are just one of the ways the Expedition is a step above the rest. The interior doesn't leave much to be desired either, and offers an abundance of space and standard features from the base model upwards. The boxy design allows for a lot of real estate inside, though the presence of some discounted materials leaves a bit of a bad taste in one's mouth considering the price tag. Infotainment in the SUV, however, is a plus from the base level and includes all the goodies one would expect from a vehicle priced upwards of $50,000. A nifty power folding function also comes with the third row for added convenience, and the safety features are endless. For such a big SUV, it does relatively well at hiding its size from the driver's seat and provides more agility than you'd expect from a vehicle in the segment from a 375 horsepower V6 engine, though it's not exactly perfect. Comfort is a given and there isn't much on the road that can lay claim to unsettle the ride. An independent rear suspension does well to improve its handling and comfort levels and provides as much dexterity as a vehicle this size possibly can. The Expedition's large frame still rolls in and out of corners, considering its curb weight and 8-seater capacity. Equipping all-wheel drive to any of the models will see an increase in all-weather capability and the addition of extra drive modes for variant terrain. The 2021 Mercedes-AMG JLS 63 The new Mercedes-AMG JLS 63 may at first look like the standard JLS SUV, but it doesn't take long to notice the many differences. For starters, there is the AMG-specific radiator grill with vertical slats and high-gloss chrome. It also happens to be the largest grill used on any AMG model. The hood has its own unique design to help fit the engine, and there are unique dynamic LED headlights with adaptive beam assist. The rear end features an AMG-specific bumper and diffuser, and two rectangular twin tailpipes complete the exhaust system. Step inside, and you will be astonished as to how far the blending of tech and luxury has come offering AMG Sports pedals in brushed stainless steel, illuminated door sill panels with AMG lettering, configurable ambient lighting, and a twin high-resolution 12.3-inch digital displays that are contained within a single glass cover. The driver and front seat passenger benefit from AMG-specific, multi-control seats featuring seat climate controls and massage functions. Even the second-row seats are heated, while this is optional for the third row. 
a three-spoke AMG steering wheel and aluminum shift paddles will also please the driver. And to top off the comfort side, Mercedes offers a standard AMG ride control, consistent of air suspension and the adaptive dampening system. If AMG is known for anything, it's their incredible engines. The AMG JLS 63 is powered by a 4.0-liter twin-turbo V8 with 603 horsepower and 627 pound-feet of torque. This engine is further integrated with a 48-volt electric system called EQ Boost Starter Generator and is with the functions like boost, gliding, and start-stop engine functions. This setup is capable of a 0-60 to 60 time of 4.1 seconds and a top speed of 174 miles per hour. Meanwhile, a 9-speed automatic transmission distributes power to the 4MATIC all-wheel drive system. The 2021 Cadillac Escalade The Cadillac Escalade has been the defining vehicle in the luxury brand's lineup since it first appeared on the scene in 1999. Although that first-generation model was a little more than a rushed rebadged job of the GMC Yukon, Cadillac quickly established itself as the leader of the full-size luxury SUV. Unlike many SUVs, the Escalade has always retained body-on-frame construction, but with this latest generation, without question, it's the biggest leap forward to date. Cadillac knew not to miss too much with the Escalade's instantly recognizable exterior. Although it rides on a new platform, the 2021 Escalade can't be mistaken for anything else. Up front, the SUV receives Cadillac's new signature vertical lighting element featuring sleek horizontal headlamps. The vertical taillights contain a unique light signature along with three-dimensional layers and finishes with more detailed etching. This Escalade has an industry-first curved, paper-thin OLED screen as opposed to the typical rectangular ones. The result is a cabin design that integrates technology and many handcrafted details. This tech includes three screens, a 7.2-inch diagonal touchscreen, a 14.2-inch cluster display, and a massive 16.9-inch infotainment screen. Overall interior and cargo space has also increased, with 40% more third row legroom and 68% more cargo space behind the third row. Rear passengers also benefit from a pair of 12.6-inch touchscreens making up the entertainment system. Unlike any previous Escalade generation, the new SUV offers something else entirely new. This time under the hood, a 3.0-liter turbo diesel engine with 460 pound-feet of torque. The standard engine is the naturally aspirated 6.2-liter V8 with 420 horsepower. Both engines are paired to a 10-speed automatic transmission. A trailering package is standard on all models, though the more advanced trailering integration package is optional. The 2020 BMW X7 If you want a big, spacious 3-row SUV with seating for 7, but you demand luxury and style, something like a Cadillac Escalade would be up your alley. However, when the consideration deviates from the American-made options, German quality is the only way to go. With unrivaled quality, performance, and style, the European offerings are market leaders. For a company that once never had interest in SUVs of any type, BMW has now produced one of the most impressive SUVs ever built. However, this is not your regular, affordable family car. The X7 is controversial in styling, but BMW claims that its buyers outside of Germany like the larger grills that are the current bone of contention with BMW styling. Along with those massive grills, the front end gets disproportionately narrow LED headlights and fog lights, which help make the X7 even taller than it is. On the roof, rails make the car look longer, while a choice of 21 or 22 inch wheels adds further visual mass. Inside is a beautiful interior, exactly the sort of ambiance you'd expect from a premium luxury SUV, and a wealth of gadgets that include a pair of 12.3-inch screens, one of which manages driver info, with the other for infotainment. The cabin also offers a variety of colors and finishes, with the choices including wood, leather, and aluminum. The two front rows offer incredible comfort thanks to their versatile adjustability. The second row can be had as a bench seat or a pair of captain's chairs. The third row is best left for kids. The base model is known as the X-Drive 40i and is fitted with a 3.0-liter turbocharged inline-6 that produces 335 horsepower and 330 pound-feet of torque. With an 8-speed automatic Steptronic gearbox, the base X7 and both other variants for that matter have very smooth acceleration with no turbo lag. The engine's responses are similarly refined with a willingness to get you moving, whether it be from a stand start or when you need to overtake. The 2020 Lincoln Navigator If you want the biggest and best that a three-row luxury SUV has to offer, the Lincoln Navigator is hard to beat. Despite being plagued by a less-than-compliant ride thanks to its blingy 22-inch wheels, the Navigator is still a symbol of luxury and power that cassettes its occupants in comfort. A large and boxy vehicle, it nevertheless exudes a sense of luxury 
with the massive 22-inch wheels, a large chrome grille, and LED lighting at the front and rear. The Navigator can seat 7 in its standard configuration, surrounding occupants in lavish leather and rich wood, which includes second-row capsized chairs and a third-row bench. The second row can be spec'd with either a pass-through or a console, but for maximum seating capacity, you can option in a bench, increasing the passenger count to 8, including the driver. The third row can host two adults, but only for short trips. The Navigator is only available with a single powertrain configuration, but it's a good one. The 450 horsepower 3.0 liter twin turbo V6 sitting up the front produces 510 pound feet of torque, and despite the massive curb weight, the Navigator feels properly quick, with more than enough grunt to get you away from the line gracefully. The 10 speed select shift automatic provides intelligent gear selection and smooth shifts. So, which one is your favorite? Let me know in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on notifications for the latest car reviews and news. Take care, and see you in the next one.